Hey guys, what's up y'all? It's uh, Tony here, also known as I am Furico. Uh, you're very welcome along to tonight's stream. Um, today we're going to do uh, the last, probably the last thing, uh, wrapping up uh, the Azora's Rat season of, season series of videos. Um, we're going to do these uh, last episodes, so there's two of them, I believe. Um, they were additional DLC as well, so... Um, Let's give them a go and see what they were about. So, one of the world's greatest warriors appears before Azura. His name is Ryu. So, Ryu from Street Fighter, I guess. Uh, he challenges Azura to a duel and they exchange punches in an intense battle. It should be an intense, not a intense. Okay, let's not get pedantic with uh, our grammar. Uh, Ryu is then suddenly consumed by Satsui no Hi Sasui no Hero. Apologies for my uh, presumably horrible pronunciation. Um, okay, so let's go and see what uh, what all this is about. Uh, start episode. Yes, I know who Ryu is. I don't know the Sasui ni Hero thing, <laughs> but um. Okay, characters appear in this episode are voiced only in Japanese. Fair enough. So that means you get to hear to me, get to listen to me ramble uh, even more than usual. So last episode one, at last someone angrier than me. Ah, if it isn't Ryu. Ryu, now where could this be? Azura, hmm. Right, well it wouldn't be the first time I've been sent off to some strange land. Azura, who the hell are you? I am Ryu, who's asking? Azura. Azura, is it? How about it? Care for a match? Huh? You look like a worthy opponent. You have no idea. The question is, are you? Well, let's find out, so. And the one way to find out... Eternal Challenger Ryu. Oh. Hang on now, I don't know what the hell's going on here. <laughs> My ass kicked. Um... Yeah, this is not going well. I suspect we're going to lose here, but, um... Oh no, we won! Awesome, so it's weird, it's kind of 2D fighty, but uh, we can't jump or do anything. We don't, don't appear to be able to do any of it. So... This is kind of odd, but, um, very interesting. Let's... 
Okay, it's, a, it's an interesting little thing. Hopefully that's not the entirety of it, but um, that's, that's quite odd, uh, but interesting. Okay, a bit early on that. Probably going a bit overboard there for poor old Ryu. So what is this? Hatred incarnate, evil Ryu. Okay, so is this going to be more 2D fighting or I wonder something more akin to... Um, something more akin to what we typically had. I'm going to see. There's a sword. A sheet for a sword, I guess. I think. Oh, this is where we fought um, your man. <laughs> okay. Mesatsu. Alright, so this is a uh, more traditional fight, I guess. Suits us fine and grandi. to it so far. Okay, I guess I really don't want to get caught by that kind of crap though. I'm having trouble with my prompt appearing there for some reason, but uh, but, uh this is fine, we're doing fine. Man, I gotta get stuck. Caution that I'm back like that. Alright, so this, this is going fairly smoothly for the most part, I mean, it's not a perfect performance for me at all in terms of, uh, in terms of fighting this guy, but, um, Probably could have and should have avoided that. <laughs> oh, whoa. Alright, crap, we're, we're nearly dead from that. This should bring us into burst, I reckon. Give us a... 
Yeah. Oh, well deserved. Deserved victory, maybe? I just fail him. Wouldn't bloody f <laughs> Oh, for God's sake. Alright. Oh, and we're back to... Okay, so when we get to the end of the fight, hit all the buttons. Seems to be the moral of the story. Don't turn your back to him, that I learned the hard way, can Let's dodge for a bit while we uh, cool down. There we go. Damn it. This, this is new. we didn't have that last time. He's actually doing better against me this time, I think. Still can't believe it that failed that bloody button mash at the end. I think, I think if I get to that again, the best approach is to just hit all the buttons uh, as much as possible. It's kind of cheap, but it'll work. Okay, so we're gonna die, I reckon. Yep. <laughs> Okay, maybe I did well to uh, to beat that the first time. do about them attacks to leaders from like long range that just seem to get me no matter what. <laughs> I really do. Maybe like that, dodged them at the last moment. That seems to work better always. Okay, there we go, 
that went by this. Alright, so this is going much better. Oh, wow. I know where I dodged that. Come on! Okay, so I'm not quite sure if we got it there eventually using the boost, but um, it seemed for a bit there that no matter what I was doing, it wasn't working very well. <laughs> That's trouble as well. Okay, this is obviously gonna hurt, but we're still reasonable-ish condition, I guess. Not beyond us to pull this out of the bag yet. dead at this point, we do kind of need um, <laughs> a bit of luck to win this at this point. Much less trouble with that the first time. Okay, I shall have to be ready to bash all the buttons here. Okay. That seemed to go okay. He's back to regular Ryu. Okay, you're pretty good. Zora, you're not so bad yourself. That wasn't a true me. Let's have another go. We'll just end up losing. Well. <laughs> what do we have here? Your skills show promise. Who's getting involved now? To be continued. <laughs> Alright, we have some credits uh, to go through here, which is uh, fine. So we'll watch them before uh, proceeding on to um, the second last episode with Akuma, presumably. Um, that's interesting. I'm not sure how I feel about the 2D thing. It's fine. The actual Ryu fight then up on the moon or whatever felt a bit cheap at times. Um, I, 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 I don't know, cheap is wrong maybe. Uh, I feel I dealt with it fairly easily the first time and then it was a lot harder subsequent tries when I thought I knew what I was doing. Uh, but most fights go the other way where you get your ass kicked and then get better. But, um, an interesting turnaround, I guess. Uh, Akuma should be fun. It'll probably be, probably be more the same. I wonder a kind of two D fighty thing followed by an actual fight. Akuma does have some uh, rage to envy Azura, so that might be that that 
might be or will be interesting. We shall see. So yeah, it's just, they're pretty short episodes, I guess. Really, um, I don't think this costs very much. It might have been a euro or two, maybe. Um, I, honestly, I honestly don't remember what I paid. Um, so, yeah, it's, it's not going to be a significantly long uh, DLC or a big massive expansion like um, like I guess part 4 of this game was but it's an interesting little little aside anyway but um, I guess we'll see about the uh, Kuma fight when we get to that I'd say this DLC was an afterthought as well, um, particularly given as it wasn't uh, English voice acted, I'd say they just kind of like um, threw it on to the end, like, oh, we own Street Fighter, let's use that in this. <laughs> I'm sure there was probably a bit, a bit more thought to it than that, but... Um, It does kind of seem that way a little bit. <laughs> We're just coming to the end of the credits now, and uh, hopefully we'll go on to the next episode. And um, see see what Akuma has for us. Akuma was always my guy in a uh, Street Fighter as well. By the way, I should say, it's just a good solid character. I like playing as him. Okay, so we're not gonna have done great here given we died. Wow. Synchronic great was crap. Um Mission mode has been unlocked. Unlock more challenges every time you play. Okay. Return to mission menu. Let's return to mission menu and see what that is. All right, so there's um, there's just crap we can do. Um, back. Um, let's just do episode two. I'm not not overly concerned about uh, doing missions. So let's see. After his battle with Ryu, Azura is confronted by Akuma, the fighter who seeks to surpass all. They clash in a fierce battle that escalates into both of their transformations. Akuma into Oni and Azura into Mantra Azura. No one knows how far their battle will take them past the limits of their humanity. Already, let's go. Well, Azura isn't really human anyway. And Akuma, mm, question mark on him as well, I guess. Oh, 
Okay, voiced in Japanese only. Yep, yeah, we know that. There's Akuma himself. Any crack, Akuma? What's going on? Okay, so what do we have here? Your skills show promise. Here, are you? <laughs> okay, Akumi, you're only just going to make me mad. <laughs> you don't want that. You have a spirit that thirsts for battle. Akuma, your name. Azura. Akuma, girl. Satisfy my hunger for power, god of wrath. Do not call me a god. Okay, this 2D nonsense again. Okay, couldn't get in quick enough when I'm there to do anything really. Sanso Bayunku, what's up? I'm not sure how to pronounce that name. Sura uh, loses. Okay, so we're gonna need to do that again. Um, how's it going? Uh, this is a weird Street Fighter Azura's Wrath crossover thing you're looking at. <laughs> Xana is fine, cool. Xana it is, that's a lot easier. <laughs> um, yeah, fantastic game, Azura's Rat. Uh, good you're familiar with it. It's um, <laughs> it's one, one of the uh, just random games from my backlog they decided to pick up. Uh, having a lot of fun with it. It's kind of crazy and insane, but in a good way. Okay, we got him. Yeah, they're they're very awkward to control these uh, Street Fighter e fights. But it's a fun little concept, but yeah, they're, they're, they could have done a bit more with them. Alrighty, let's see. Oh no, round, round. Okay. Not expecting this. <laughs> I thought we'd be done. Uh, 
Nein, ich wollte dann. Is on anyway, any any crack with you? Support the rat. It's always uh, always good to support the rat. Uh, <laughs> yeah, particularly my channel is small, so any and all support welcome. <laughs> Thanks very much for hanging out. Uh, fun game, fun game. I did did a full playthrough of it. Uh, really enjoyed it. Uh, my favorite boss was um, I think my favorite boss in the whole thing was uh, Bison, where he becomes the size of a planet and tries to crush you with his finger. I just found that uh, very entertaining. Crazy, but but entertaining. <laughs> PC version, I don't, uh, I don't really have much of an opinion on. I mainly game on consoles myself. Just. Um, just because I do, I guess. Um, okay, let's see what this fight is going to be. Oh, that's a promising start. <laughs> Probably laugh at how bloody terrible I am at the game. <laughs> uh. Oh my god, this is not going well. I've never fought him before, Zana. This is the this is uh, this is my first first go at him. So um, I've been playing this blind. It's literally just a game that was sitting in my backlog, and I was like, ah, you know, I fancy fancy playing this. <laughs> okay, we got him. Yeah, the boys and finger thing. I, I just found it hilarious, though. I have to say. <laughs> How did I end up coming out of that so badly? Oh, 
Okay. Anyways, we s seem to be doing all right for the moment. Say it right before getting bladded. I think I might have them. Oh, we're doing this again. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, we got him. I think. Firing any crazy button pumps like the last time against Ryu. <laughs> See what's happening. We're destroying the moon apparently. This kind of crap right here is why I like this game, just insanity. <laughs> General insanity. <laughs> but in a fun way. Fight down to earth, <laughs> destroy it or guy it, should I say? <laughs> How do you find? Uh, I'll catch up with your chat in a minute, Zana. I'm just trying to not miss my uh, button prompts. But uh, how do you find speed running the game? Um, I assume you have to sp sp skip uh, the cutscenes and that, uh, so you really need to kind of learn it a bit and know where the prompts are. Um, it'd be it'd be an interesting game to uh, to speed run. I guess, but you you'd really have to learn it. Oh 
I imagine anyway. Like for me, I've I've never played this before, so I'm kind of having to pay attention uh, to see what what happens. Okay, so 500 years later. Uh, sorry, no, I'm just catching up on your comments. Uh, game is quite epic. It is indeed. Um, yeah, QTEs ahead of time, memorizing exactly how the fight works, etc., etc. Yeah, there are a couple of fights that I think I got by, but I didn't do very well. Um, particularly that final spider form thing, the guy with the six arms, I found he'd do an area of effect attack and I'd just zoom in and hit him once or twice and he'd keep doing his area of effect attack so I just kind of kept going with it. Um, it got him down but it seemed quite slow, I'm sure there's a much faster, better way of doing it. Well, here we go. End it. <laughs> To be continued. No, it's not going to be to be continued. Alright, here's the credits. We'll let them play out and see if there's anything after them. Yeah, I found... Um, at episode 18 I had to... Uh, so I think I had... I had actually five S-Ranks, but two of them were in the DLC episodes. 11.5 and 15.5 maybe, so I had to go back and do a few others. And I actually found... Um, found the boss boss levels uh, really easy to S rank when you kind of understand how it works and you're not dying uh, to them because you just don't have a clue what's happening. Um, yeah, bosses, yeah, once once you figure out how to do them or a good way to do them, you're on to a winner, I guess. Um, large crowds of enemies, I didn't really have too much trouble with the, the mobs. There was one fight in um, part 4 with the big tortoise and there's a load of lads there as well. That was particularly tough because you were just getting... You had to fo focus on the big tortoise thing, but um, there were loads of other dudes around. So that that was quite um, quite tough. <laughs> that was the only, only real time I can think of that uh, the mobs gave me trouble. Bashing through the credits, um, this is going to be the end of my Azura's Rats uh, streams, unfortunately now. Um, can't see, I think, I'm fairly sure I played through it on normal. I don't know, is, is, there, is there much points on it? You probably know uh, to going back and doing it on hard or messing around with any other difficulties or anything. Just in summary as well, I should say, um, for, for other people watching, uh, for anyone watching in general, Azura's Rat, really, really fun game, guys, do go check it out, uh, it's crazy, it's kind of like, um, it wants, it feels like it wants to be an anime, but um, it's complete crazy, over the top, mad stuff, uh, it's really, really fun, kind of stupid at times, but really, really fun, so... Do go check this one out uh, if you were looking at it at all and uh, and enjoyed some some of it, some of uh, what you saw because um, this stream today kind of the Street Fighter crossover it's a bit cheesy but it, when it's doing its own thing it's probably it's probably happier as a game and even more crazy. I say planet size planet size bosses are just one of those things that happens and they're fun. <laughs>
Alright, we're just getting towards the end of the credits now, so... Let's be ready and see if there's any more... Uh, madness yet to come. I kinda suspect that this is probably... Might be the end of it, but you never know. Cool, Zana. Uh, thanks for hanging out. Uh, uh, thanks, thanks for stopping by the channel. Hope you had a good time here. Um, I will have a great day. It's light night time here uh, in Ireland, so I'll probably be heading to bed soon. Um, God hand, awesome. Enjoy that. Uh, you have a good day as well. All the best. <laughs> Just wrapping up here anyway, so it's a good time to step out. <laughs> okay, let's see what we got. C, not brilliant there. S on battle. S in synchronicity, so no, hey, oh, that's okay. Mission mode has been unlocked, so I guess we return to the mission menu. Um, bum 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 bum. Okay, blah 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 blah. Uh, probably not going to do that. Um, okay. Guys, those were the two lost episodes from uh, Azura's Wrath. Hope uh, hope you've enjoyed them. Um, I'll be back on tomorrow. Probably probably going to do... Uh, probably going to start doing some FIFA streaming, oddly enough, tomorrow maybe. Um, and in terms of next game that we play really... I haven't decided yet, but uh, maybe something else from the backlog. Uh, we'll see. So, guys, thanks for hanging out, as always. Hope you had a good time. Uh, we'll see you hopefully tomorrow. All the best.